Alrighty guys, it is another year in the books. So, I just wanted to go over what I thought uh, my top 10 moments of 2019 was. There's some really good ones. Uh, the very last one, I guarantee you none of you guys saw it. Uh, because it happened in the comments and uh, it's pretty bad. So stay tuned for that one. So, we're going to start at number 10, and I had called this one the Crazy Fish Ocean when I was writing it down. I have a note right here. So, yeah, let's see what this one's about. Now we got something on this rod. Yep. Yep. Oh my god! <laughs> oh. He's got someone else's bait in his mouth. <laughs> That's crazy. Number nine is a little bit more recent. Uh, it was that doe that I shot with the 223. Uh, this year was one of those years that I, I wanted to do things that I've been saying I wanted to do for a long time. Using the 223 was one of them. So this year, 2019 was definitely a year of, man, I've been talking about doing that for a long time. And I did a lot of them this year. Daddy hit her. Yeah? Yeah? She's nice. She's gonna taste good. Huh? She's gonna go good in your belly. Number eight is the biggest buck that I've ever filmed. Uh, again, another recent one. Just unbelievable. It's, it's rare enough to see them. It's another thing to get them on camera. Just really, really. Uh, I'm blessed to be able to have private land to hunt. Uh, I really hope that buck made it. Number seven, the opening day of rifle season 2019. I'm just going to go over some of the highlights with you guys. Between the amount of deer that we've seen, the bucks that we've seen. One of those bucks I know is dead. Uh, the farmer sent me sent us a picture of it. So, But that palmated one's alive, to the best of my knowledge. Um, haven't seen him since the first day, but he, he could still be alive. I haven't heard anything about him being shot. Number six, 
is bow fishing a flooded field. So this spring we had yet again some torrential rain and I took advantage of it. They, uh, they opened the floodgates on the dam upstream which floods out the creek down below and it floods a field and I've always seen carp when they when this happens in here. So come on. I went bow fishing in a field. Air mine. A little low my shot, but not too bad. Number five is the trout tour, which that happened back in April is when I did the trout tour. Uh, hoping to do it bigger this year, bigger and better. Uh, haven't gotten anything planned out for sure yet, but it's in the works. Essentially, the first day was the best one, the best day, and we just, just hammered the fish. Absolutely hammered the fish, and uh, yeah, you guys, you guys will be able to figure out just how good fishing it was. Number four, bow fishing the Susquehanna River. Yeah. Now I'm not going to tell you exactly where I was on the river, but it was unbelievable. The amount of fish that we shot, yes. uh, we filled that trash can up, and at the end of the night, we also had two visitors hanging around the boat with us, which... Uh, made it pretty interesting number three uh, me and my buddy Craig wanted to take an old canoe down through the city and do some bow fishing just figuring not a lot of other people can get there and uh, it, that was true not a lot of people could get there and uh, we ended up flipping the canoe while we were in the middle of our float so, enjoy. Ready? Yep. <laughs> Dude! What the fuck? I didn't even get in quick. Oh, man. I didn't even get out Number two, taking my son fishing and just seeing how hooked he is, no pun intended, on uh, going fishing. It's, it's in his blood. So I'm, I'm really happy that he's so obsessed with fishing. And it's even worse with hunting. Every time I come home, he wants me to show him the back of the truck. And he goes, Buck? And I'll have to tell him no. And he'll go, Doe? Nope, didn't get doe either, buddy. And uh, it's cool. It's really cool to see him enjoy something that I also enjoy. Do you want to go fishing today? <laughs> Are you going to catch a big one? <laughs> Are you going to catch a big fishy today? <laughs> yeah? What do you want to go fishing for? Carp. Carp? We don't fish for carp. We shoot carp. Come here. Real. Real men, buddy. Real, real, real. Real old men. <gasps> Ready? What's that? A fishy. Just for Bree. All right. Let's let him go. And number one. The number one thing to happen this year, YouTube related, was a certain person commented on one of my videos uh, as you guys can see right there uh, seemed pretty harmless at first you guys can see what I said and uh, he responded back and then I responded back and then he said this and uh, yeah that was weird 50% girl thinks I'm hot. That's not too bad. The other 50% is a dude. That's not okay. For me. I'm not into that. But 50% girl thinks I'm hot. 
So I hope you guys enjoyed that last one. Um, yeah, kind of, kind of odd, to say the least. Flattered, but YouTube was the last place I thought I'd get solicited uh, by anybody. So I just want to say thank you guys so much for uh, your continued support. We're almost at like 1,200 subscribers, which is crazy. Uh, it feels like just a couple weeks ago, which it was a couple weeks ago, we hit that 1,000 subscriber mark. And uh, I, I really do want to make a video of like the journey to 1,000 subscribers. Um, I just got to sit down and work on it. I've been so busy with the holidays. Trying to spend time with family. I'm processing deer right now. I'm hunting. It's been a little busy. So I do want to make that video. And uh, the journey to 1,000 sounds pretty good. But I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoy these videos, please leave a like. Let me know what you thought down below. And until then, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.